CompTIA A+, Core 2, Complete Training Course. Exam Objective 1.3, Given a Scenario, Use Features and Tools of the Microsoft Windows 10 Operating System. System Configuration. System Configuration is a Microsoft Windows utility that allows you to manage and troubleshoot your system startup process and services. In other words, it is a toolkit for managing how your computer boots up and which services run in the background. It provides a simple interface with several tabs, each offering specific functionalities to help you fine-tune your system. To access the system configuration utility using the Windows Run dialog box, you can follow these simple steps. First, press the Windows key, along with the letter, R, on your keyboard, to open the Run dialog box. Next, type msconfig.exe into the Run dialog box, and click OK. This command opens the system configuration window, where you can start managing your system startup and services. The first tab you will be presented with is the General tab. This tab offers three startup options, Normal Startup, Diagnostic Startup, and Selective Startup. Normal Startup loads all device drivers and services, ensuring all installed programs and services run as intended. Diagnostic Startup loads only basic devices and services, similar to Safe Mode, which is useful for troubleshooting issues. Selective Startup allows you to choose which system services and startup items to load, giving you more granular control over the startup process. Next, the Boot tab lists all installed operating systems and allows you to set the default OS, configure advanced boot options, and set the boot timeout. You can choose from several safe boot options, such as Minimal, Alternate Shell, Active Directory Repair, and Network, each tailored for specific troubleshooting scenarios. Other options include No GUI Boot, which disables the Windows splash screen during boot. Boot Log, which creates a log file of the boot process. Base Video, which uses basic video drivers. And OS Boot Information, which displays driver names as they load. The Advanced Options section allows you to set the number of processors, maximum memory, and other settings for troubleshooting specific hardware configurations. As for the timeout setting, this specifies how long the boot menu should be displayed before the default operating system is automatically selected and is particularly useful if you have multiple operating systems installed on your computer. The Services tab displays all services installed on your system, including both Microsoft and third-party services. You can enable or disable services to troubleshoot and optimize system performance. The option to hide all Microsoft services simplifies the list, allowing you to focus on third-party services that might be causing issues. In Windows 10, the Startup tab in System Configuration provides a link to Task Manager, where you can manage startup applications. It's like system configuration saying, hey, I've handed off this duty to task manager. Go see my fellow utility for further assistance. So, if you wish to view a list of all applications that run at startup and enable or disable these applications, you'll have to head over to task manager. Prior to Windows 10, system configuration was the location where all these startup configurations happened. But now, it's all about task manager. By clicking the link, you'll be taken to Task Manager Startup tab, where you'll find detailed information about each startup application, including its name, publisher, status, and startup impact. Lastly, the Tools tab offers quick access to various system tools and utilities, each listed with a description and launchable directly from System Configuration. Examples include System Information, Event Viewer, Performance Monitor, and Resource Monitor. Do any of these sound familiar? I sure hope so. Collectively, these tabs make system configuration a vital tool for managing system performance and troubleshooting startup issues. By understanding how to navigate and utilize its features, you can optimize your system's performance, diagnose issues, and maintain better control over your computer's operations. Thank you for watching. Subscribe for more great content.